Hi, Dad. I'm so excited that your church family is honoring you today for your many years in ministry. We couldn't be here today, so we wanted to make this video for you. As you know, the name of the church we serve at is called Canvas Community Church, and I'm sitting in our auditorium right now. Canvas is a church plant that has grown from five people meeting in a living room to nearly 200 in less than two years. God has called our family to serve and lead in this church. And trust me when I say that this has been one of the hardest but most rewarding experiences of our lives. Watching you and mom serve the Lord with all of your heart and soul has greatly impacted our family's lives. Thank you for showing us that there is no higher calling than serving our Lord and Savior. Go into all the world and preach the gospel to all creation. One thing that I will never forget about you is you are singing all the time. And I know that's a trait you've given to me too. And the first time I realized that neither of us even notice when we're singing is we were both in the same room and singing out loud and we weren't even singing the same song. <laughs> but as you know, this year I've really felt God calling me to be a worship leader. And you have made such an impact on my life on what I really think a worship leader should be. You were the first person I ever saw that not only just led people in the songs, you led people into the presence of God through the songs. And one verse that reminded me of you is Deuteronomy 6.5. My deepest desire is to worship and love my God with all of my heart, all my soul, and all my strength. And that's something that I see you do every single day. I have so many memories of you and mom praying and spending time with the Lord alone. And still, every time I come home, I see you praying together after you have your coffee in the mornings. And it's a beautiful thing. And I just want to thank you for setting that example for your family and for showing us that being a servant is important, but knowing God is the most important. He alone is my rock and my savior my stronghold. I'm sitting in a coffee shop where a community youth group meets that my parents started. It's called graffiti and to us that means to leave your mark. And this youth group is definitely doing that. It's changed so many teens lives and it's really helped to set my school on fire for God like never before. I know mom and dad seeing you and grandma change youth lives really put the fire in their hearts to do the same thing. And I thank you for that. Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations. Both of you have been through some really rough waters in the past few years. Well, maybe more like raging storms. But one thing I can say is that you have taught us more through these, how you've handled these trials than any other times in your lives. You have not only shown us that you can praise God in the good times, but you've shown us you can praise Him in the storms. Sing praises, for God is King of all the earth! And finally, I want to thank you for showing us and so many others that no matter where you've been in life, and no matter what your situation is, God is here. God of miracles, God.
Take our lives, we surrender them to you. In Jesus' name. 